Half of my friends are men. I don't have female friends. I don't. I'm, I'm incapable of that. Why? And, what do you mean? Well, because, you know, come on. Because you have a wife. Real. Well, I have a wife, and I don't, I don't really have female friends because, look, okay, let's get rid of this myth <laughs> I right here. Know why. Okay, I'm going to tell you this. Let's get rid of this right here. There, you, you're an attractive woman. There are some guys somewhere saying, yeah, I'm, we're friends. No, that's not true. He's your friend only because you have made it absolutely clear that nothing else is happening except this friendship we have. We remain your friends in hopes that one day there'll be a crack in the door, a chink in the armor, and trust and believe that guy that you think is just your buddy, he will slide in that crack <laughs> the moment he gets the opportunity. Because we're most guys. Men think this way. Ninety-nine point nine percent of us think that way. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. I've, I've seen this before. Um, I, I mean, I have a lot of female friends. I mean, it's. Um, it's, it's tough, man. It's tough because, like, uh, it's either, like, s sister or a friend, you know, kind of what Steve said, you know, a friend that you hope, you know, maybe they'll let you slide in one day. But I do have friends that are considered, like, sisters, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Like, you know, no sexual attraction, just, like, talk, having a good time. Uh, but we don't see each other like often, like maybe once a month, twice, you know, on, on the holidays. But in your, we, we, we in your, barely in your, even like. In your past relationships, uh, did your your girlfriend know how much female friends you had, or was she aware of that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. She, uh, she didn't even like it, man. She was, she was, she was kind of insecure about <clears throat> herself. We're not okay. I won't say insecure about. She was always uh, jealous about, um, you know, hey man, cause you were situations. Catch. You were catch. That's why I mean. If, if I was good. But, uh, but I also think that is why she was so in love with me because she always thought that I was going to, like, run away or, like, somebody else was going to get me, you know? Sweet. So she was always on her, on her own toes, you know? Yeah. And, like, she'd be saying stuff like, I don't, I don't <laughs> explain myself. I don't need to explain myself. I was like, oh, it's just, it's just a job. Like, I don't know, I'll go out and shoot uh, videos um, on visuals and stuff. And the girl, my girl be like, oh, man, you, 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 are you sleeping with her? You messing with her? Because she knows, like, whenever I do drink, I get, you know, very talkative. Yeah. I'm just really friendly. I consider myself friendly whenever I drink. But she thinks that it's too friendly. Also, when you're sober, too, you're friendly. <laughs> yeah. But you, you right, exactly, you're... right? And and then you just a little bit more friendly. That's all. <laughs> okay. She don't like when I drink at all, man. When I drink, like she she gives me attitude. Like she's like, you're too touchy. You're too talkative. <laughs> and she hates that. She hates that. But I also feel like that was kind of something that uh, that I liked, man. I like being, um, you know, being that extrovert. Huh? A stud. Yeah. Be <laughs> happy to start. Yeah, I love it, dude. I love just like talking, bro. And I don't do that enough whenever I am sober. You know, it it, it sucks to say, <laughs> but you yeah, know, yeah. I need it a, sucks to say. I need to get rid of this frontal lobe real quick. <laughs> give yeah, me, give me four um, shots, dog. You hear that, dude? <laughs> it sucks because like uh, it, it doesn't really suck, but it's kind of a struggle right now because like I'm on a path of not drinking. I mean, I have drank before, like maybe like two, three weeks ago, um, and I had like this liver panic attack. Oh, damn. After that, dude, um, I decided not to drink anymore. So I'm I'm on this path of uh, sobriety for the next we ninety can't, days. We can't we can't drink like we used to, man. We can't drink like we used to, dude. <laughs> yeah, man. Uh, but let, let me tell you this, dude. Let me say this: whenever I did drink, right. I was at I was at the the, uh, the festival, and um, this lady came up, bro. Like I looked up, and like the love of my life just kind of like. Oh, I was like, "Holy shit! Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. What do I do?" <laughs> so um, the interaction kind of went kind of like I was so sober, too sober for this, <laughs> and uh, she was. She was kind of in the middle of like you know the line. I I didn't know if she was in line or if she was out of line. So I was like, 
I was like, where's the line? And she was like, oh, this is the line. Like, oh, okay, cool. So we we kind of went behind her, and I was like, oh, so now you're cutting in front of us. And she was, and then she got kind of upset and kind of like said something. She was like, well, you guys are short, something like that. And I was like, whoa. I was like, where did that come from? I was like, shit, man, relax. Like, I was just so brain farted because like, I haven't flirted with a, with a new, with a girl in, in like forever, a new girl in forever. Yeah. And I wasn't drunk, you know. The drunk Frankie wouldn't know exactly what to do. You wouldn't know what to say, what to do. Yeah. <laughs> but I was just so stunned. I was like, "Oh man, now I'm too sober for this, oh, man. man." It's great, man. I I love the uh, the tipsy uh, Frankie dude, man. That's hilarious. But my my girl made me hate my, my girl made me hate it to uh, hide that shit. So um, you know, deuces to her. <laughs> my ex girl, I would say. If you're listening uh, to this, it's all your fault. Yeah. But I'm boring now. <laughs> that is why I'm boring. I'm not gonna get any girls until I drink again. Um, oh, no, that's funny, dog. <laughs> you wanna go and go to the next one? Uh, actually, actually, I, I had another question. Right? Is uh, is, yeah. is that is that um, because we only got like four minutes left, right? Yeah. Let's stick with this segue. Yeah. Okay. So, so my follow up question is like, is is uh, in your future relationship, is that going to be important to you to have um, female friends, or, or you know, your female friends from from before, you know, the uh, the love interest happened, right? Is that going to be important for you to have around? Because like, I tell you, for me, I don't have female friends, um, just because Baku can't handle it. <laughs> so I, you know, happy wife, happy life, right? So, so my question to you, right, is 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 are you gonna Still have female friends too. Um, it depends, um, because most of my female friends are, you know, part of what I'm trying to do. You know, yeah. they're either um, business a woman. Um, it's more of a business relationship, I guess. Yeah. Rather than uh, in a networking relationship, versus like a casual friend. I want to fuck you one day, but if they let me. I'm just saying, if one night we like, hey, you want to go out and we just end up being at your house and like, I just need some quick dick, Frankie. Come on, <laughs> I'm on my way. Uh, I, I'm, I'm be honest with you, man. Uh, even at that point, I still wouldn't do it that, dude. Because I don't know, man. Like, I, I feel bad, man. Like, there's so many times that I fucked myself over. Because a woman was drinking and she was drunk and we wanted to have sex, oh, but yeah, I didn't yeah. have sex good, good, because, good. because you know, like I just didn't feel like right doing it. Um, I've always been like that. I've I've screwed up many times, bro. To be like three times, I fucked up from not doing it because the girl was was intoxic. Um, I'm telling you, man, I'm a good dude, bro. I'm a good dude, like. Good man. But there are times that I have done it when they were in to- they were toxic too. So okay. So I'm not I'm not much of a good dude too. It's all consensual as long as it's all consensual. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's the biggest thing. It's consensual. Uh, Both parties are intoxicated. Both wanted to fuck. Everything's good, yeah. dog. Legally, everything's good. <laughs> yep. Yep. Facts, Tom. Oh, facts. Facts. That's funny. I think I think um, I think what you mentioned is very important. Right, casual friends, uh, like like the the women friend that I had in the past were were casual friends, good friends, right? But uh, you know, I've I've since I've since kind of you know um, haven't communicated with those friends, right? And so in terms of work friends, that's that's all of the acquaintances that I that I do have, um, female wise, right? So so I think that's okay. Yeah. Even uh, even right now, like I have um, I have dinners with uh, with a friend of mine, uh, and she's an actress. We kind of just talk about uh, you know uh, personal growth and how how we're doing, how she's doing, and things like that. You know, um, yeah. So think, it's just casual. Especially, well, well, it's it's cool that it's casual too, right? But but you you guys are still kind of in the same industry, right? The entertainment industry. So then, yeah, yeah. that's where networking does make sense. You know. Uh, and having those, yeah. you know, um, authentic relationships do make sense, right? So, yeah. But. Um, but I do have a lot of gay friends too. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah. 
Yeah, so um, a lot of gay friends. They uh, I I track a lot of gays, man, and I love the gays, bro. They uh, they're actually really nice. Gay people are nice. They they're people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They just like they, they uh, like sucking dick. You know, what I'm saying that's that's all. That's the only thing. That's the only difference, dude. <laughs> yeah, dude. Every time it's just funny because like when I do see them, I do ask ask them like like gay questions yeah. just for like the fun of it. Yeah. Like, would you suck that guy's dick? Would you suck that guy's dick? How, how big do you think that guy's dick is? Yeah. And, like, it's just, like, dick things all over the place where, like, they don't care. They love talking about it. Yeah. You know? And not that I like talking about it, but it's it's just um, something to... Well, it's because it's a different perspective. Uh, yeah, I get it, man. Yeah, yeah, into yeah. Pussy. Pussy, pussy, yeah. pussy. And then, so, when you ask me... Kitty cat. Kitty cat. Kitty cat. Kitty cat. Cat. <laughs> uh, let me see. Let me see if uh, Jimmy. We, 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 we can <laughs> say dick, but we can't say pussy. What the fuck kind of world we live in, dude? 